All right, this is interesting music. I really like the uh, the galaxy effect in the black. That's really cool. So yes, this is fine love or die trying. So let's see settings. What do we got for settings? Full screen resolution, message speed, skip mode, read only, effects volume. Okay, I think settings should be fine. So let's start a new game. <coughs> and see what this is all about. Episode 1, Pilot. Okay. Z's. Um, save, load, log. Okay. Play. Hey, don't just lie there. Get up. Just five more minutes. You're the star of the show. You can't just sleep through it. Watch me. <laughs> oh, that's how you want to play? Yeah! Ow! Rise and shine, sleepyhead. Okay. Ow! Did you hit me? Nah, I just got here. I just chased off the person who hit you. <laughs> really? You should be thanking me. I'm pretty sure. Thanks, I guess. Don't mention it. It's all in good day's work. I like this. This seems fun. Anyway, what's your name again? Oh, my name's... I can't remember my name! Wait, what? I swear, I didn't even hit you that hard. Aha, so you did hit me! Oh, hey, you did hit me. <laughs> That's not important. Try to remember. If you can't remember anything, we're both going to be in big trouble. Why is that? We can't talk about why after. What is your name? It's... Enter time. Graphics works. Or should I do something now? I'll just do graphics works. And my pronoun is. Oh. Oh. So it. Interesting. It goes for everyone. That's that's pretty cool. Let's go he. My name's Graphics Works. It's Graphics Works. I can't remember anything else though. Well, I should try hitting my accountant sometime. Do you remember where we are? What are we doing here? No, I can't remember anything. Everything's so foggy. Alright, I can give you the rundown. You're on a reality TV show called Fine Love or Die Trying. Though we just call it Fine Love for the uninformed. Okay. I'm the producer. The name's Cat. Okay. The premise is that you, the suitor, are living with five beautiful women, and one of them is your soulmate. I haven't even met them yet, how would I know which one of them is my soulmate? That's just how it is. Welcome to reality TV. You'll get to know two of the girls over the six days, over three dates with each of them. Okay. 
Then on the seventh day, you'll have to ask one of them to marry you at the final ceremony. Okay. That seems straightforward enough to me. Not so fast, partner. The girl you choose will be given a choice whether or not they accept your proposal. Shit. This music's really good. If she says yes, you two will fade off into the sunset in a gold-plated yacht on the last day. Gold-plated yacht? Damn. Happily ever after. Forever. Except without the yacht. It's a loner. <laughs> okay. Music's up. If she says no... Well, we're going to have to kill you. What? You're going to kill me? You're joking, right? Damien. Now that's the reaction I want. Damien! Markiplier! What? Really, you look like you just took a shit in your cereal. Okay, that sounds like a fucking Walking Dead thing. What's going on? Who are you? Well, where are my manners? The name's Damien. Damien Black. I'm the CEO of Royal Black Media, the biggest network for Battle Royal games on the planet. Battle Royale games? Like computer games? You better have been living under a rock stink ass armpit. Real people killing each other is in this season. Okay. What? Well, was in this season, I swear. I put in hard and honest work to make top of the line killing shows, and what do I get for it? So we're trying a new kind of killing game, spicing a little romance on top of for the people who fart dreams and bake cakes out of rainbows. <laughs> okay. That's where you come in, and hey, it's not a bad deal. You might find love, or die, whatever. Just put on a good show for me, hmm? Excuse me, Mr. Black. Security? What is it, one? We're missing one of the aerial cameras for the black for the backfields. Well, that's my cue. The intern ain't gonna shoot himself. Give him hell, Kit Kat. You don't need to tell me twice. Look, I don't know what's going on here, but I'm getting out of here. Damn right. For starters, you can barely remember my own name, let alone if I already have a partner. Well, if that's what you're worried about, you didn't. And not for a lack of trying. How would you know that? Hmm. Look, you don't have a choice. Damien will kill you if you try to escape, or if you tell any of the other girls about the truth behind the show. The girls don't know? They have no idea that your life is in danger. They just think it's a regular dating show about finding your soulmate, called Find Love. If you tell any of them the truth, you won't just get yourself killed, you'll get them killed as well. 
How could you? I don't make the rules. I'm sorry. Really, you're a pretty serious person. Most people would be a little happier to hear that they're alone in paradise with five beautiful women. What's there to worry about? Oh, you know, the whole getting executed thing if the girl says no. The little bit we're not remembering who the hell I am. How about this? I need my show to be successful and run according to plan. And you want your memories back, and presumably to leave this show alive. That depends on what the memories are, but yes. If you'll be a good suitor for my show, I'll help you get your memories back. It's really not a bad deal. Most people would kill for a chance like this. Seriously, all you have to do is get to know five lonely women and ask one out. I'll be with you every step of the way, off camera. Before you know it, I'm sure you'll be having lots of fun. Who knows, you may even fall in love. You wouldn't be the first. But if you survive the whole show, I promise that I'll tell you everything you want to know. Pinky promise. How does that sound? Sounds like a deal. That's the spirit, sugar. Who knows, you might even be thanking me for this one day. We'll see about that. Trust me, I'll make sure that this show will be the best time of your life. It'll be so great that everything after will feel like a disappointment. Hmm. <laughs> That's a depressing way to look at it. What if I ended up with one of the girls after the show? Anyway, without further ado, let's get started with the show. Follow me, I'll take you where you'll meet our lovely contestants. Crap. Grabbed me by the hand and pulled me along. Remember, you can't tell anyone the truth about this dating game. No matter what, just smile. Got it? Got it. We stepped out of the bar together. I didn't realize it at first, but I was in a bar in a small airplane. I guess I must have been flown here. We walked until we saw a mansion in the distance. It's huge. can't imagine how expensive this place is. You'd be surprised. Since we're all the way in some forgotten corner of New Asia, the land comes pretty cheap. New Asia? Have you never read the news in the past decade? Memory loss, remember? Jeez. 
for sorry for forgetting shit. Right. Well, I'm sure hope you haven't forgotten how to talk to girls. I don't know. Five, four, three, two, one. What? We're starting already? Not quite. To give the world top tier enjoyment. To protect our ass from unemployment. To make the world believe in fate and love. We will work like slaves for the shills above. We're the Brothers Five. What? Prepare to get the set ready. I want to start filming yesterday. Oh, I guess we're not important enough to finish our intros. Whose idea was it to work in the TV industry anyway? This wouldn't have happened if we had just decided to be accountants. Wait by the mansion doors and thank me later. It's showtime, people. Let's get to work. I walk to the doors. Hey, can you hear me? Yes. Cat's voice boomed across the island as though she, though she was nowhere in sight. Cat? I wasn't kidding when I said I'd be with you every step of the way. As long as you're on this island, you'll be able to see, hear, and even talk to you. Just think of me as... A cuter and sexier big brother. That doesn't sound nearly as good as you think it does. Hey, how else could we film the show? You really want to meet the love of your life with a camera sticking out of your head? Good point. Yeah. Anyway, head into the mansion already, and go meet the girls. I remember checking out the library, the kitchen, the games room, and the backyard. Wink wink, nudge nudge. From here on out, the cameras are rolling. Don't be stupid. I'll see you later, sweet cheeks. Cat out. Alright, I'm finally here. There's only one thing left to do. Open the door. Anybody home? My eyes were drawn to a girl wearing a white dress pacing around the lobby. Hey, what's up? Whoa, didn't see you there. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, it's really you. That's me. How did you know my name? It hasn't been that long, has it? Oh, it hasn't been that long, has it? It's me, Yui. Yui Fushikawa. Hmm? 
We went to the same high school way back. Come again? Yeesh, you haven't changed one bit. Always forgetting everything important. <clears throat> Wait, calm down. I know how it sounds, but I've got amnesia. You don't expect me to believe that, do you? You can't lie to your student council president. That's perjury. <laughs> okay. It's true, really. I wouldn't lie about this. You really can't remember anything? Well, no. Really, I wouldn't joke about this. Promise. Scout's honor. Oh. I can't believe you forgot! What, she gonna smack me? No. Okay. On second thought, that might be a good thing. How on, how on earth could it be good to forget everything? You know, moving on from the past is the best way to live and all that. Everyone has things from high school they'd rather forget, right? <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Hmm. <laughs> it's good to see you. You haven't changed. It feels just like when we used to fool around back then. Fool around? In a family friendly sort of way. Pinky promise. It's good to see you too, Yui. What brings you out here? Oh, you know. To be honest, dating apps or shows and all that really aren't my thing. But I saw that you were here. Oh. Okay. I see. What you making me say? <laughs> Uh, besides that, welcome to the mansion. Um, it's ginormous. I'll spare you from embarrassing yourself asking me and show you where my room is. Uh, wait a second, I haven't cleaned it up yet. She rushed off before I could get in a word. Somehow I get the sense that this has happened before. I guess I'll see her later. I should get back to exploring the house. Where to next? The library, the kitchen, the games room, or the backyard? Hmm. Well, I will decide in the next episode, because I'm going to end this right here. So, uh, if you guys like the video, please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel to see more awesome videos. I can't wait to continue this game and see what partakes and see our other lovely lady contestants as part of this death defying, not death defying, but like deadly game show of love and death. Um, so if you want to try to find love or die trying, you can find this game in the description down below. And as always, I hope y'all have a good one, and I'll see you around. Bye-bye.